All right, so there's a lot of different ways that contacts can go into the CRM. They can come in through web forms, through web chats, through your social media. But if you want to just actually just add someone to the CRM, that's what this video is all about. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to navigate on our you know, navigation panel over here. We're going to click on contacts. This is going to bring up our CRM. Now we've got a couple of options here. There's an add contact to where we can add just one contact at a time. And then we also have an import contacts. If you want to import a list, I've got another video called bulk importing and exporting. Uh, be sure to check that one out. That one's going to go a deep dive into importing contacts. It'll walk you through, you know, how to format your file and things like that correctly. Now, if you want to just import one contact, you're going to click on this little plus button right here. It says add contact. And when you do that, it's going to bring up a sub menu with some basic information. And so first up, we're going to add a name. So let's go through and add Brad Pitt. We'll give him an email, brad at troy.com. I just saw that movie the other day. We'll give him a phone number. Oops. And once we have that, you can go and select contact type. Is this a customer or is it a lead? And you can also um, do not dial. You can select that if you want. Um, I don't do that. And we're going to click save and it's going to save the record into the CRM. Now you'll notice if you jump back over to the CRM, when we, he now is a record there that we can see it. So as you can see, once you type in the basic information, it brings up additional fields that you can edit and add into. So we've got a date of birth here. You can have a contact source. You can add some tags. Uh, we can give them an offer. We can add them to different campaigns and opportunities. So spend some time going through adding to the record. The more detailed they are, you know, generally the more information you can use to um, you know, sell and uh, work on your, your prospects. So go through the contact section, also the general info. You can add like a business name or address. And you can also have additional info, like if you have additional fields that you can create. We've got some videos on adding custom fields like these. If you have some more information you want to save on the record.